Hi there, you with IBN Living and I am Guinea Narula. Now, one person's effort to make Kutub Minar disabled friendly has finally led to extensive changes being made at the monument. On World Disability Day, Sminu Jindal is our citizen journalist reporting from the historic place. Hi, I am citizen journalist Sminu Jindal. On World Disability Day, we are here to share a small accomplishment. We read Kutub, the very first World Heritage Site to be made accessible for all, including the children, elderly and disabled. I'm now able to access this site with ease. It wasn't always like that. I've been wheelchair bound since I was 11. I knew how difficult it was then for me. I didn't want it to be more difficult for other families facing similar circumstances. That's when I probably decided the first thing I want to do when I grow up is to make public infrastructure accessible. That's how Swayam started. We found in Kutub, the major problem areas were the sand everywhere, which made accessibility a major challenge for anybody who was driving a wheelchair. There were steps which made it very difficult for the children, the elderly, the wheelchair. We started giving the authorities a plan of action on paper. We were there at the time of execution. That's where the paved floors come into picture, the ramps came into picture. You know these ramps, it really doesn't spoil the beauty as much as one thought that it would. It just makes life easier, not just for people who are driving wheelchairs or maybe walkers. What about children, the elderly population? It took us about two years of hard work, but I think it was well worth it. If you want to join us in our crusade, do write to us at editor at swayam.com or ibnlive.com. This is citizen journalist Sminu Jindal signing off for CNN IBN.